Hello and welcome to another video. Today I have this Audi A8, this 2008. It's 3 liter engine, 171 kilowatt. Engine is ASB. This really doesn't matter so much because today I will show you how you can decode this adaptive light. I do have a video on internet for Audi A6, but you request to see a video also for A8. And this is what uh, I will do today. You notice here on the cluster, this one is adaptive light and another one is TPMS. I'll make a separate video how you can also uh, code or decode this TPMS. First of all, we go for the adaptive light. I already scanned the car. Okay, but before to make coding on these modules, we should remove the fuse. It is totally different. It is not like um, Audi A6. You notice we have on the fuse 44. Give me one second. Over here, 43 and 44, we have adaptive light. Okay, it is this one from here, 43 and 44. I will remove this two uh, fuse. And after that, after coding, you should remove the fuse number five. I don't know if it's able to focus this shit. It's the instrument cluster. Okay. I will show you also where this one it is. It is right here. On the second line, not the first, the second one, this one, the corner. But this is when you are finished with uh, coding, okay? Now I go to remove the fuse and we go from there. And I remove the fuse. We switch on. Okay, we go to instrument cluster first. You see the coding is here. Take a picture. Code the module. What we will replace is the first two. From the number we make minus 32. This is the old coding. We will put now the new one. Zero, zero, one, six, zero, zero, three. It's done. Okay, we switch off. Now the instrument cluster, it doesn't know anymore. Here, we go back. The next one will be 09. The modules are similar with uh, A6, okay, the number of these modules. You have here the coding number. Okay, here we replace the coding. And what we will replace here, actually, is not the fourth number like in the case of uh, A6. We replace the third one, okay, this one. And our coding number will be now 0123121, okay? Instead of 4, we add 2. We switch off. We go back. We switch on again, and now we go on the gateway module. And we go over here on long coding. And our module will be the 55, it's this one. 
and we press now coding. Okay, it's finished. We switch off and now we remove the fuse from the dash. And this one, I will show you which one will be. It's this one, okay. We leave it for 10 minutes or at least five minutes, we put it back and we start the car. Okay, the fuse is back on the position. Let's start the car. You notice we still have the issues for TPMS sensor. But this uh, TPMS sensor, I will show you in another video how you can decode this option, okay? I close the video here because it's not so much to say, not so much to show you. I hope you learned something. I hope this video, it was useful for somebody there. And like always, thank you for watching. Bye bye.